how to fix attachment unavailable on Facebook Messenger. Hi everybody, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from App Guide. In today's guide video, I will show you the way on how you can actually fix attachment unavailable on Facebook Messenger. But before we get started with this video, if you are new to our channel, then do make sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. Now, before we try to fix this issue, you have to understand why this happens in the first place. Let's say somebody sent you a particular media on the Messenger app, and for a while it was just fun, you just tapped on that link and used to watch these videos or memes, but over time it simply said attachment unavailable. Now that is because the media which that person sent you or shared with you, it has simply been deleted by the owner themselves or the original poster. For example, let's say I post a certain video, and then somebody shares that video with somebody else on Messenger, and if I delete that video and the link is basically within the messenger app but when they tap on it it says attachment unavailable so that could be one of those reasons why other reason could be let's say somebody sent you a message and they could have sent it deleted or sent it and that could also be another reason so in this case there's nothing really we can do about it and this is nothing really to worry about because when it says attachment unavailable it simply means that the original attachment has been removed from facebook or from messenger itself so you have to simply understand that and hopefully this video answered your question as to what happens when there is attachment unavailable. Still, if you want to find related memes and so on, then you can just open up Facebook and you could search for related videos to ask to share with your friends and so on. But as of moment, there is no way you can restore the original video or the attachment which the owner has themselves deleted it. So hopefully this video answered your question. If it did help solve your problem, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have got any more questions, queries or doubts, simply also make sure to leave them down in the comment section. Thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video.